Beneath the sands of the Sahara Desert, scientists have discovered evidence of a prehistoric megalakey. Formed some 250,000 years ago, when the Nile River pushed through a low channel near Wadi Tushka, it flooded the eastern Sahara, creating a lake that at its highest level covered more than 42,000 square miles. These two images show the relative size of a mega lake in the Sahara Desert, reaching 810 feet above sea level and covering 42,000 square miles left, and a smaller lake at 623 feet above sea level, covering 18,600 square miles. The Nile is at lower right in both images. National Air and Space Museum geologist Ted Maxwell and colleagues recently spotted evidence of the lake while studying radar data of Egypt taken by the Space Shuttle Radar Topography Mission. Using images of wind-blown sediments, sediments produced by running water, and bedrock seen by radar beneath the desert sands, the geologists pieced together the profile of an ancient megalakey. Egypt's extreme aridity enhances the ability of radar to see distinct subsurface features. Kisiba Oasis, Southern Egypt. This oasis is along one of the ancient watercourses discovered by geologists using space shuttle topographic data. Using fossil fish found in deposits some 250 miles west of the Nile and at 810 feet above sea level as a marker of the lake's highest shoreline, the scientists estimate the Nile once flooded the entire Kasiba Tushka depression of Egypt, creating the giant lake. The location of Paleolithic human settlements near the areas of Selima and Tarfawi in Egypt correspond to a lake covering some 42,000 square miles, the scientists determined, placing these settlements in what would have been desirable, near water regions.